Hello, hello. I have arrived. But yes, so, archives. It's been a little while, huh? Yeah, I think. Yeah, I think we didn't do an Arc Knight stream last week, if I remember correctly. Yeah, which is a little bit unfortunate, but it happens. Let's see, I certainly... I don't know whether or not I did it, an Arc Knight stream. I definitely didn't do as many as I was hoping for. And I almost didn't do as many as I was hoping for today. Which is to say, one of them. But yes. So, yeah, we're a little bit later than I would like. By roughly an hour or so. But we will make this work as best as I can. So yeah, so as a result, it's going to be a little bit shorter than perhaps usual. Yeah, no topic for today, or at least no side topic, I suppose. Even if we did have one, there wouldn't really be time for one. Let's see, anything else to go over before we get started? There are, there are things to discuss, but I don't want to talk about it too much right now, because I do want to get into the game. Because yes, I have been delayed, been delayed far more than I would like. So, let's get right into things. Yeah, everything should be operating appropriately. And I even went and took the time to double check which stage I was on last before we got started today. So, let's begin. Rhodes Island sure is taking their time. Oh? We're almost at the interception point. <laughs> Finally. I just finished unpacking. What a waste. Hurry up. Those in the back. Follow more closely. Hey, masked person over there? Who is it? What do you want? All of you, come at me. I'm short on time. Amia, Texas from Penguin Logistics Fix has returned. Ah, <sighs> what a relief. I have an update here. I just took care of some guys who called themselves Reunion. But there are a lot more of them coming. Reunion has come out of hiding and are starting to move in groups. It's as I feared. Reunion has already infiltrated Lung Men through the slums. And their target is the same as ours. Otherwise, there would be no reason for them to come after Rhodes Island. Miss Misha is carrying secrets that only Lung Men and Reunion know. We're caught in a disadvantageous situation. Things aren't looking good for us right now. I'll really have to poke that officer's pretty little face later to find out what's actually going on. Anything else to add? If not, I'll lead the way. I know exactly where to go. Exusi has confirmed our escape route. I'll now take you through it. Franca, gather all the squads. We... We should find cover first. Union is already here. Over here! Don't let them get away! There's nothing more annoying than when trouble keeps nipping at your tail. Something's wrong. No. They... They have a leader. Ugh. Watch out. Skull Shatterer, they're right here. Yes, that's her. Casters, go. Tear them to shreds. They mean business. Watch out. The enemy has deployed multiple casters. Prepare appropriate countermeasures. What they're after is... Misha. Uh, who are you? Finally. I... I've finally found you. Who are you? So yes, so it's time for another boss stage. But yeah, I don't... I think we might want to switch the squad around a little bit. Because we, we definitely aren't very well equipped for this. I'm definitely going to want a more proper vanguard. As much as I appreciate Yato and her service, I don't think I'm going to go that much more... I don't think I'm going to go that much further without a proper source of, of uh, deployment points. So, currently we have 
I suppose Beanstalk is an option. I don't remember if I've shown Beanstalk. She's a little bit different from most Vanguards. She's pretty fun. I like playing with Beanstalk a lot. But I think Courier is the most standard option. I think I'll go with him. Leave the scouting to me. A little bit higher than the level range that I was hoping for. But a lot of my units are, so it is what it is. So yeah, as another thing, I think I'm going to, if I can, get a B cell binder supporter. A slower, basically. Let's see. 12F. I think on this particular mission, 12F won't be incredibly useful, so I'll go with Angelina. In work or in battle, I'll give it all I've got. Alright. I still don't feel like I'm all that well set up for this, but I will do what I can. Ah, actually, this is Everybody, a different stage than I was expecting. I, I was thinking of a different one. Well, hmm, now I need to rethink things even more. We'll put, no, I want to, yeah, since I've got a source of deployment points now in the form of Courier, I'm going to deploy him first, and I shouldn't have deployed him there apparently because that's within range of the enemy. So, how are we going to deal with this? Chen will survive even shorter than survive even shorter than him I think given her lack of hit points Jump. yeah this is uh, unfortunate hmm well we'll just have to play this by ear I suppose All right. hmm here I come. So interestingly, okay. Hmm. So Norkhorn is within range, but Rangers is Did not, it would that? seem. And I suppose Cicero's in a less than ideal situation here. <laughs> How do we want to work this? I think I'm going to put down Lane. A war song. Hmm. Yeah, I really don't like this situation down at the bottom, but we don't have a whole lot of choice in the matter. Deploy a summon to take a little bit of pressure off of Cicero and Noir. Get a little bit more healing. And yeah, we'll deploy another summon. I definitely don't have the block that I would like, but we're doing all right. Hmm. Okay, we're not doing very good, actually. We could be doing better, at least. Please. It would have been best if we had deployed the summons earlier. And if I had been a little bit more mindful of the range on the elite casters. But I did what I could with the information that was available to me. We'll deploy another one to distract the caster. That dual striker will probably pose some trouble for Courier, but Courier is fairly high level for what he is. So he may not be in that much of a problem. Alright. Deploy another summon. It's really nice that I can just keep oh, oh dear. Just keep deploying new units with uh Ling. Like I said. That's not a quality that every summoner has. At least not at these relative. Well, I was going to say relatively low levels. She's level one, which is the lowest level she could be. So there's nothing relative about it. So yes, Courier doesn't really have the power. Doesn't really have the power we need, but we don't really need any more. Moving out. We don't need the... What's the word I'm looking for? We don't need the DP anymore, basically. If nothing else. Hmm. Alright, we don't have a summon available. But I think Ling should be able to deal enough damage. Oh, this is all very unfortunate. Hmm. 
Tamiya will take some damage, but she'll at least be able to put some damage down as well. Doberman, I don't... I'm not very confident about Doberman's performance here, unfortunately. But she can at least attempt something. Truly something, even. Hmm. So yeah, definitely... Ooh, I think we might just lose here, actually. Unless. Unless. Hmm. No, we've lost here, unfortunately. Hmm. Did I? Oh. Ah. I forgot how ladies. As your heart wills. I forgot how late summons work. As your intoxication. Let's get out of here first. So, here, let's way. try that again. Yes, I. I had thought that she regained her summons passively over time, but no, I have to activate her skill to do that. So that's why we ran out. I suppose I should probably be practicing. But yes. So, Angelina did not contribute in any meaningful way in that engagement. We might be reaching a limit to what we can feasibly, feasibly accomplish with our very, very low units here. But yeah. A lot of them simply do not have the damage we're looking for, or the healing we're looking for, in the case of the medics. I'll give it another try. I should have switched out Angelina for someone else. I don't know who, necessarily, but... Hmm. This tile is nothing of any particular interest to me. Alright. So let me check. Okay, so that is definitely outside the range of the elite casters. When will all these Unfortunately, I don't have another end? sniper to deal with the other elite caster. So, since we're going to be contending with Forwards. this foe anyway, we might as well place... Who has better healing? Cicero... Cicero has slightly higher attack. So I think I'll place her here for some more reliable healing. And behind Courier, I'll place Doberman. That was a bad that was a bad choice actually. Because now everyone's going take to take damage. Orders. So I'm actually going to retreat Doberman. Alright, this enemy is going to be down soon, so we'll put down Noir Horn. I've got this. Since he is no Speed longer up. no longer in tremendous danger. Now I'll place Ling here. For the marching, a war song. Place a summon here. Ah, in that position, the summon is being attacked by two casters, and thus it is absolutely not going to last very long at all. Yeah, fortunately, we don't have to worry about any sort of uh, aggro, in a sense, with the casters. Once you attack them, they don't start moving toward you or anything. So yes, we simply can let the caster blunt their blunt their assault upon the summon. Courier is going to continue struggling here for a little while, I think. But at least he's Has going to survive. To one word to address all beneath the heaven. One scope to spare mm. none upon the earth. Let's see. Courier is actually holding his own pretty well here. Better than I expected, certainly. I suppose that comes with the fact that he's one of our highest leveled units currently. But yeah, unfortunately he doesn't... Oh, right, 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 right. I forgot about the crossbowmen. They were sort of a non-issue earlier. Oh well. So, Courier has just deployed me... To yeah, provided me with some additional deployment points, and I don't need him desperately. So, I think... Hmm, I don't really Moving have time to, to waste. We'll deploy Dev Oberman, or we'll deploy Chen. Yes, and deploy behind her, Doberman. Okay. So yeah, it would appear that they do have a little bit more, a little bit more HP on them than I hmm. might perhaps uh, like to deal with. Hmm. I could have deployed another medic, I suppose. Alright, alright. 
So yes, we're close to a good strategy here. I think I will retreat for now, and we'll try this again. We have failed. I am the one to blame. Mm, I wouldn't go that far. So let's see. We are, yeah, recommended level 35. I suppose we could just probably level up some units, at least some of the ones that I'm planning on using a little bit more. So yeah, so Chen will level up. I don't think we'll level our, her up to 35. We'll go up to 25. I think that's a good number. It's all in the service of more efficient operations. And I certainly hope that we can get some more efficient operations. I was hoping to clear this stage today. So yes, we'll level up Ling. Oh yeah, I don't know if I, I don't know if I demonstrated Ling's skin all that much. But yes, I definitely, I know that I had mentioned that I had purchased a skin for her. I guess we saw it while it was in the shop. So that's probably a better view than this anyway. Though antithetical at a glance, your nature is quite similar. Thanks. I'll take that as a compliment. The I don't know that it was meant as one. A thousand times. A city lone in desolation, vivid in the mind's eye. And we will level up Doberman. Help her feel a little bit better about herself after our failed mission. This is how our training pays off. All right. So, I think that should be good. Most of our uh, units here are either above the recommended level or cannot be cannot be leveled up any further. I'll also place another sniper in our ranks. Hmm. I just realized I was a little bit incautious. It won't, it's not a huge deal, I suppose, but I think I might just, there's a few units, there's a few units here and there that have some implications for the story going forward. So just to let you know, in the future, I will try to avoid showing them until I feel it is an appropriate time. I'll try to avoid showing them until it's an appropriate time. And so if I do end up showing them by accident, then I will, I will blur them out or something in the uploaded Just give bar. your orders and I'll carry them out. Not a huge deal, I don't think, but I can be a little bit particular sometimes. Let's get going. All right. So All right. Jessica and Rangers should both be safe. All right. We're going to get some enemy movement soon. We're going to get some enemy movement soon. The fire is spreading this way. Get ready. Hopefully, I maybe shouldn't have deployed two snipers immediately. Yeah. Though I suppose Rangers Please. is very, very low cost as far as snipers go. I'll have to deploy Courier here, though it is within range of being attacked because I need him to be there so I can. I need him to be there so that I can heal him. So yes, so this is a little bit less than ideal, but the casters will be dealt with shortly. I don't think I'm going to deploy Ling just yet. Yeah, I'll wait on Ling for a little while longer. Okay, Jessica has served her purpose, but I will keep her around for a little while longer. I've got this. Oops, not Durin. Durin is quite useful for what she is, but I don't need her right now. And so, as I was doing before, I will deploy some more of Ling's summons in this general area. I'll wait a little while before retreating Courier for him to uh, provide some more deployment points. Come on, say something! More corn shouldn't need healing for a good long time. He has a lot of backup. Let's see, that summon's going to go down shortly. I wonder if this is outside the range of the other caster. It'd be nice to get both both of them defeated shortly. Truly is one word to address all hmm. beneath the heaven. One scope to huh. spare none upon the earth. And Okay, okay. So, we need some stronger units over service. here now, ideally. So, let us deploy Chen. Take him out fast. 
If I placed Chen a little bit further, I could have also deployed Doberman to provide a little bit more damage. But Chen, now that she's leveled up appropriately, should be a lot better off. But yes, I don't want I don't want Ling to get shot too much. So we'll place another summon. You don't need to be around, so we'll retreat you. Let's see. Yeah, if I thought this out a little bit more, I could have also placed Noir Corn forward slightly and gotten Doberman behind him, perhaps, too. But I suppose Rangers will be able to provide some support as well. But yeah, Chen has the very significant benefit of high damage output. So we don't need to worry about her too much. Plus, Jessica has higher damage output than Rangers anyway. Yes, Noir Corn. However, it doesn't have a whole lot of damage on his own. The split halberd sinks in the sand. That's not doing us Great much aspirations good. Unrecompensed. But yes, Chen, now that she is leveled up, is is Zip. really, really messing things up. But yes. So this is much, much better, of course. Then now that we've figured out a strategy that works. Which is to say, being even remotely near the levels that the game recommends that you have. Now that we've figured out a strategy that works, Command we can strategy. deploy, we can employ that. And honestly, we might as well, well, I was going to say, we might as well just retreat and save ourselves the time of ending the mission, but... I managed to protect everyone by myself? You did a great job, Jessica. We really appreciate you. But yes, so, let's do this stage for real now. But yes, not so much a, tra a change going. in strategy as much as just a change in our units. But Got it. that's a certain strategy in and of itself. Mm, I don't know, maybe it's not. But, They'll pay for what you know, they've done. like I said, I'm not really going for a challenge necessarily. I want this to be a little bit challenging. No mercy for me. But not so much so that we are that we have a that we don't have a smooth gameplay experience. Yeah, okay, there's not really any place where I can put Courier. We'll have both be able to be healed, but also be able to be supported by Doberman. So I think what we'll do is we'll just deploy him where we did previously. We could always retreat him a little bit earlier. We could always retreat him a little bit earlier and simply, ah, we should heal him now uh, or else he will perish. But yes, that caster is going to go down shortly. You'll deploy Ling. A war song. The fallen, hmm. a lament. Here right. I come. Didn't like that so much because now Noir Corn is in a suboptimal ah. position, especially like doubly so. He was even more so than he was previously. Right, I remember now. The reason that I didn't put the unit there is because there it will be able to be targeted by both casters. But what we could do, I think this should work. Hmm. Okay. The second, the second uh, summon is taking a little bit longer to summon than I expected. So this is maybe not actually going to work quite as well as I was hoping for. But my, the what I was thinking, the idea of placing down, placing down a Has unit. Come to my speech? Your heart wills. Yeah, the idea of placing Be down a unit at both wishes. positions so that one would distract one caster and the other would distract the other caster does seem to be, it seems to have some merit. It's not a bad idea necessarily, but the execution was a little bit poor. At your service. So yes, so once again we'll place Chen basically where she was no for me. because that suited us just fine. Jessica's doing fine where she is as well. We need healing, or else Ling will suffer greatly for it. But yes, we have one summon death, or we have one caster down, so we can deploy another summon to deal with the other one. Hmm. Yeah, Noir Corn is doing okay, but again, it's mostly the units in his lane that are supporting him. 
Jessica, I think, can probably be retreated. So we can place a little bit more damage on the bottom lane. But, on the other hand, that might not be strictly necessary. Mostly, I just like to prevent her from getting too shot up by... Has it come to my too shot up by crossbowmen. In the sand. Great aspirations unrecompensed. Yes, so that should be the caster dealt with. And that'll be a, a delay for some of the units up there as well. Chen basically doesn't need any support, to be honest. But yes. So, we'll make the things a little bit faster. Make things just a little bit faster for us. Just so treat you. Put a little bit more damage. And we'll put even more damage, perhaps. Mm. I don't like Courier blocking all this damage himself, given that he's out of healing range, but the mission's over, so it's not a huge deal. There what go. a satisfying battle. Indeed. But yes, one thing you might notice is that the missions, or at least most of them, have a limited drop. This is with regards to the current event that's going on. Yeah, we had one event going on last time we played, I think, but now we have another one. So yeah, so this is an event, I don't know, I think I'll go into different types of events later in more detail, but for now, all you need to know is that this particular event, this particular type of event, is one where you can gain certain these resources by playing basically any stage, not necessarily stages specifically related to that event though you can also get them through playing stages from that event. Dog's being a little bit noisy today. Oh well. Sit. But yes, you don't necessarily need to play stages directly from that event, though you can get, get the resources, and it's different for each event, which is why I simply say resources generically. But yes, you can get resources from playing basically any stage, not literally any stage. For instance, Annihilation stages don't yield them. But yeah, it is a it is a type of event where you can get resources from playing any stage. I feel like I've said that too many times at this point. But you can, and you can then exchange those for for other resources that are more useful to you. Because these ones go away after the event ends. Anyway. Let's see the after story. Amia, hurry. Miss Misha, please follow us. How can this be? This way, hurry. This area is clear. Be careful, they're still after us. Are they also? Yes. Reunion. They're also infected. Why? Why are the infected fighting each other? Dull Shatterer, you let them go? Don't worry. They can't run. But I finally found her. No, no. She's finally come to me. Yeah, our first good look at Skull Shatterer thinking that, that we would be fighting Skull Shatterer in this stage, but I was incorrect. We've arrived. Are you serious? That's what the markings say. But this route is heading up, isn't it? How's that going to help us? Amia, Amia, up here. That's right, come up here. Exusiae, are you certain? Trust me, I wouldn't mess up. I know Lung Men's roads like the back of my hand. Uh, uh. Let's head up. Wouldn't that be waiting for the enemy to surround us? If you don't hurry and reunion finds us, maybe. Wait, you guys go first. I'll go up. I'll go weld the gate's entrance so reunion can't go dead in. There's a penguin logo on the staircase here. Is this the place? Sure is. Head forward, then take a left, then take the stairs up. 
that will take us inside the building. Weren't we going to go underground? No, no. I just said we were heading upstairs. Upstairs? Are you sure she's trustworthy? As long as we get to the destination, any route can be taken. That's one of our mottos here at Penguin Logistics. Just try our service once. You'll love it. <sighs> Sorry, Misha. I didn't know. <sighs> hey, you. Hmm? Are you Dr. Tiber of Rhodes Island? We sure are. You don't seem to like climbing stairs. I don't really. I'm not too fussed about it. But I try not to climb too many stairs if I can avoid it. Here we are. Huh? We have to go up to the rooftop? This door is locked. Stand back. I'll blast it open. There's no need for that. Just kick it down. Miss Garm, you should learn from her. I have my own way of doing things. Got a problem with that? There's another rooftop in front of us. I think I'm beginning to understand. Um, yeah. <coughs> Ugh. That was a weird... That was odd. Anyway. Amiya, over there. You'll be able to cross from over there. Where is there? Are you telling us to jump from rooftop to rooftop? Bingo. Who would ever expect this? See, this is foolproof. You know, Lungman is a great place with many secrets. You're not getting away. Huh? What's going on? Susiai, the enemy showed up unexpectedly. I already sealed off the entrance, so how? Could they have come from the nearby buildings? They seem to be wearing some rudimentary jetpack, but it's enough to get the job done. We'd be at a disadvantage if they managed to sneak through places we weren't able to defend. Hold on, I'll be there to help you shortly. Don't take too long, my little guardian angel. Defenders get into formation, pronto. I'm going in. Everyone, protect our vanguard. All right, let's begin. Let's start with a, a practice this time. And if we think we're doing particularly well, we might hazard a... I want to dig a hole in the ground and make a shelter to sleep in. Fair enough. If you don't mind. Ooh. Yes. If we feel like we're doing well, we might just hazard an early retreat and then play through the stage normally. All right. Put Jessica in place for a little bit more damage early. All right. On. Rangers won't be able to hit those enemies, but you will be able to hit any enemies that come from the south. Yes, we have two spots to defend. Ah, right. Um, ah, okay, so this isn't quite the... How's that? Or no, actually, Please. I think, I think, uh -huh. this should be an appropriate stage to place our little friend here. And whether or not it will take is another thing, but... We'll give Shaw some time to do her work. Hmm, okay, and then we have an enemy walk directly into her, which is less than ideal. Because yes, regardless of which way the pusher is facing, they push enemies away from them, basically, in a line. So, because the enemy spawned on Shaw, he was pushed back towards its spawn and not towards the edge here. So actually, yeah, I'm thinking those edges aren't edges that enemies can be pushed off of. Which I suppose is something of a spoiler for the fact that you can push enemies off of ledges, but, you know. Take them out fast. It's not like a story spoiler or anything. Okay, Understood. yeah, enemies can't be pushed off. 
enemies can't be pushed off there, so we aren't going to worry about it. What we are going to worry about, however, is healing. Speeding up. We do need to heal our, our units at some point, ideally. So yes, courier shouldn't be necessary for too Don't much longer. My hand. Your orders. Honestly, he shouldn't be necessary right now, period. Hmm, I feel like Ling's in some danger. Ah. Marching. No mercy for the rest me. of us are also in danger. Yes, this should be okay. It should be okay. Summon's got quite a bit of damage on them, I must say. And we'll need that because we've got more jetpack enemies coming in. Hmm, and even more. Okay, so our positioning is less than ideal here. Yeah, we will get another summon up though shortly. Has it come to my one word to address all beneath the heaven? And we should be able to get another one on the ground. There we are. So yeah, that should be all that we need. No mercy for me. That should be all that we need on that front. Though I don't how much block do these summons have? Only one. So this may have been a bad choice up front or up top, but we were able to get the enemy defeated before it could cause any real trouble. And pass through, yeah, pass through our space here. So we're good, actually. Activate our medic skills. Well, actually, I suppose I didn't need to activate the Sura skill because the summon cannot be healed. Got it. Just for a little bit more damage to end this off a little bit quicker. I don't know that Rangers actually got a shot off there, but. It is what it is. So, now we'll play through the stage properly. Man, the end of the stream is already, already sneaking up on me. Everyone, prepare for battle. I suppose that's what happens when you start late. Got it. I'll yeah, definitely so now prove we, myself this time. Yeah, right. Now that we know what we can and can't do with regards to the ledges, we won't worry about placing Shaw there. Freeze. Instead. We'll get Courier out quickly, and we'll probably leave him there a little bit longer this time, perhaps. They'll pay for what they've done. Yes. We'll place. She won't be necessary immediately. But we'll place Chen down. Mm, no, I should have placed medics before I placed Chen, actually. It's not a huge deal. But yeah, Chen should be able to pile on the damage enough to deal with basically any any threat. Hmm, what would be a good place? I think Ling would probably be best served being positioned something like somewhere like and this. Thus has Auden made reckoned her arrival. Yeah, Jessica's gonna take a little bit of damage, but she will also receive a significant amount of healing, so that shouldn't be as big of a deal. Place another unit down, soak up some enemy fire, allow rangers to survive a little bit longer. I don't know if I'm going to place a medic here. They wouldn't be supporting too many units. Yes, Rangers, Remains, and that's always good. But yes, this is going pretty well. Yeah, we just lost a summon, which is less than ideal. So we'll place down another one. Yes, Rangers is going to survive a little bit longer, actually. Courier can probably be replaced at this point. Since I didn't take the, or I didn't really have the chance to utilize her very well earlier, we'll place down Shaw again, just for the sake of it. And 
for another, we will place Got down Doberman. I'm not too concerned about the facing here, to be honest. Yes, Chen really does, really does get the job done. Really does get the job done. And I should have placed Doberman facing downwards, it looks no like. I don't know why I was expecting enemies to come through the center, especially with the defense that we have. I suppose I was remembering how enemies got through the first time. Has it come one word to address all mm, beneath the heaven? Fine. One scope we'll to need the new... upon the earth. Mm. Yeah, we shouldn't need too much more here, so we'll place another summon. So yeah, I think these... Yeah, the enemy spawn points on the left are pretty much depleted at this point. Or at least we won't be seeing any more enemies Care coming from up. them. Very good. We may have achieved a perfect victory, but we still can't let our guard down. Sit. Alright, so, time for the post story again, and I think, <clears throat> yeah, this might just be, you know what, no, I think I'll go for one more stage after this. I thought we agreed this was going to be my grand entrance. You're too slow. The important thing is that we're all safe. We should get moving. Let's start heading back. Heading back down from this building to the east. Reunion won't know where we are. Are we safe? Yes, for now. Your complexion doesn't look too good. I'm a little dizzy. It's fine. Miss Misha, how long have you been in Lungmen? About a week? Just one week? Hmm. A lot of strange people appeared in the city, and then... I'm not sure what happened. Everyone started fleeing, so I also... It was Reunion. Reunion at attacked Chernabog. I don't know. Were you... infected before? I... I don't know. But these last few days, these things began growing on my leg. I... Misha? Misha? Medic! Where's the medic squad? Hmm. Oh, right. another tutorial. Ah, here we go. I think this is, this is where the game will start introducing us to the idea of doing what I was planning on doing with Shaw. Like Shaw, certain specialist operators can be deployed anywhere, regardless of the melee range restrictions. Their skills can also manipulate enemies to other locations, either by pushing or pulling them. By exploiting the terrain features of the battlefield, they can destroy powerful enemies with ease. Tap and hold at a location for more details. Enemy spotted. So yes, these Prepare are holes. Fight. I'll definitely prove myself this time. So yes, so in this case. Shaw wouldn't be able to push an enemy upwards, even if we positioned her facing upwards. So, instead, we'll place In Fang position. here. And we'll place Shaw here, mm. facing downwards, so that she can knock the Metal Crab, which is the creature that is crawling up on us now. Yes. Push the Metal Crab downwards. And of course, Jessica's not in a position where she can do a whole lot here, unfortunately. We can do some damage there, so it is what it is. If we position Vanilla thusly, then we'll get a little bit more utility out of Jessica. No mercy for me. And yes, pretty straightforward. Metal crabs are typically have pretty high defense on account of being metal, uh, but they are also pretty light, remarkably light for their size and for the, the fact that they're made out of metal. Yeah, metal crabs are a enemy that is basically tailor-made to demonstrate demonstrate terrain effects like that. <laughs> What's wrong with her? It's an acute symptom of oropathy, but it's only been a week. 
There's also an acute form of oropathy. Franco, which type is yours? What, are you concerned about me? Amia, if Franca passes away, I hope that Reef Rhodes Island will cremate her. Hey, that's mean, Liskarm. You're the one who's always talking about passing the infection on to me. Uh, <laughs> uh, the difference between the acute and chronic types is a rather complicated topic. However, Misha's condition is very dangerous. If we don't do anything, this condition will become life-threatening very quickly. All we can do is give her some emergency treatment. But we must control Misha's symptoms as quickly as possible. We have to make this clear to Lung Men. After this ends, we have to bring Misha back with us to Rhodes Island. <coughs> this is part of our responsibility. Um... Pardon. Is she going to explode soon? Ow, that hurt. Why did you hit me? Watch your mouth. Uh, if I'm going to explode one day, I'll make sure to crawl up to you. I'm sorry, Miss Franca. Please forgive me for everything I've done. <laughs> Let's transfer her to a safe place first. By the way, we seem to have a situation behind us. What are you doing? Get out! We're all fellow infected here. Don't make us resort to violence. Get out of our way. You've already destroyed our home, and now you're trying to get the LGD here? Forget it. You little... You ignorant fool. Get out of the way. Ah! Now you've done it. Are we going to step in? We seem to have finally lost them, but if we intervene now, we're going to be exposed. Is this going to get in the way of our mission? If so, how serious is... How serious are the consequences going to be? Of course this is going to interfere, but it won't be that serious, right? Let's do it then. Rhodes Island's unequivocal mission to save the infected, as long as the situation permits. Mm-hmm. Good. I knew following you was the right decision. What do you mean by that, Miss Franca? Don't worry, don't worry. I was just complimenting you. She probably thinks she can get along well with you. How do you know me so well? Probably because you're so annoying. Uh, it's time to teach these thugs a lesson. Yes. Be careful of the enemies who can jump between buildings. In addition, make sure to protect Lungmen's infected civilians. That's asking for a lot. But I'll handle it. Alright, let's go. Dr. Cyber, make sure to lead me in text as well. I'll be sure to do that, given that you aren't on this mission, but I'll provide moral support, perhaps. Alright, don't forget to do practice. I maybe we should have thought a little bit more about what we're going to be doing here. Ah, okay, Everyone, now we do have a place where we can push enemies off. So yeah, so these are referred to as holes. They're not really, they're, you know, ledges, but same difference, I suppose, as they say. Forwards. So, Shaw is a little bit higher level than I was thinking she was, so it'll take a little bit longer to deploy her. I guess, yeah, level is not the word I'm looking for, promoted. She's at a higher promotion level than I remembered her being at. So yes, we'll place Doberman Commence here. Tracking. Yeah, I think we might... Hmm. Doesn't look like we can push enemies off the bottom, at least those spaces don't count as holes. It might just be... yeah, okay, there's definitely some terrain there. Unfortunately, you can't adjust your perspective or zoom out or anything, so I've just kind of got to guess. Take them out fast. Ah, yes, a drone. So yes, this there. drone can increase the defense of allied units around them. So we don't want to deal with that drone very much, if at all. So, we'll place rangers, I think, here. Got it. Take that. Rangers here. Jessica here. All right. 
But yeah, I'll notice that even though even though Rangers is of a lower level, he's doing a lot more damage to the drone due to his talent, giving him extra damage against ranged units. I just remember that Chen needs to be healed desperately, so hopefully it's not too late for her. It is not. Okay, good. Chen's a tough girl. Very tough. Very strong. We've got a lot of enemies piling up here, which is a bit unfortunate. But we can do a little bit with that. Mm, okay. Well, okay, we just had a unit uh, be defeated, so this is fine. Extinguishing flames. All right. Let's see. Courier can probably be swapped out at this point. Your orders. I think the rest of these should be able to handle it. Chen is taking a lot of damage right now, but she's surviving remarkably well. How do we want to do this? Um, Shaw looks like she's in a bit of trouble, but... Ah, we don't have rangers anymore either. This is a problem. Hmm. Yeah, because now we don't have a unit that's going to that's going to prioritize aerial targets. We can still hit them with, say, Durin. But Durin isn't necessarily going to go out of her way to target them. Yes, this is rather unfortunate. So yeah, we definitely should have placed should have paid a bit more attention to our Yeah, the order in which we placed units. Oops. Actually heal, please. Thank you. Oh dear. What? Who just was defeated? Who? Who was? Oh, I think probably one of the summons. Which is, I mean, not good, but it's fine. Shaw? I think Shaw has been defeated for a while. So this is a successful, a successful oh. hole, but I don't feel great about it. All right. Yeah, we can remove these, uh, remove Standing these by. units because we Filthy don't have any stone. enemies over on this side anymore. A little bit more damage on Courier, or a little bit more damage in the form of Courier, I suppose. But yeah. I might have also wanted to simply deploy another medic. That probably would have solved a lot of our problems. Not bad. The fire is Not basically great. under control. Should I begin the damage control process? No, because we're going to try that again. All right. So this time around, we'll try to get a good hold. And if we don't, eh, I'm not too concerned. Operation this is a stage commencing. I've already beaten, so I don't worry about it too much. I think this will probably do it. better when it comes to intercepting the aerial enemies. Jessica's position right. also wasn't great, Ready? I don't think. Stick to the plan. And of course, now I've forgotten that I was also supposed to deploy Shaw. So she's going to be a bit delayed. That won't be a huge deal, but it is going to be some trouble for us. Not one step backward. Alright. Yeah, we're definitely going to want to place another ground unit over here. I suppose it won't highlight the... Yeah, over here. Now. I've got this. Attack! But yeah, I definitely don't like having the war torn specifically here. I would have preferred to have a different unit. I don't want to deploy my, my defenders immediately. I don't think we'll worry too much about... I don't think we'll worry too much about... Uh, no mercy for me. Ling right now. Yeah, I don't think she provides us with quite the value that we need immediately. But yes, if we place another medic... Unforgivable. How do we want to place our medics, actually? I think... No... Because, yeah, that'll expose Pure Stream to a lot of damage. 
This, however, will expose your stream to significantly less damage. Take them out fast. We'll place Chen here to deal with these enemies and also to take some of the attention off of your stream. But now we're at our unit limit, of course. Hmm. We're probably not in a situation where we really need to have Shaw around too much more. Ah, and that jetpack enemy. Apparently while they're flying, they can't be knocked back. That's news to me. Unfortunately, we don't have a lot of good melee units currently. We don't have a lot of good melee units, and most of our melee units are concentrated You're all in this general relation. area. So, we're not going to get all that much more utility out of these others. Or, yeah, we're not going to... That's not at all what I was hoping to say. But yes, we're not going to be able to... We're not going to be able to place any others to back up Courier, basically. Though, he might not need it, to be honest. Because, yeah, we've got more enemies coming that way, but Shaw will deal with them. And since Shaw's being healed, she's not going to just crumble like a wet napkin, uh, as before. So, yeah. So, not too bad. Yeah, that moment with Chen was a little bit scary, so it might have might have been prudent to save up the or yeah, just to not use Pure Stream's skill until it was a little bit more necessary. But I think we're going to hold. I think we're going to hold, so I'm not going to complain too much. Ah, okay. No, okay, we're fine. We're fine. Standing by. Yeah, Jessica. Was not quite and as useful there as you could have been. Made reckoned her arrival. All right, that's a solid hold one way or the other. So the fire is extinguished. Ready to return to base. Very nice. Very nice. <clears throat> Sip, and we will see the yeah, see the conclusion of this particular story, and then we'll conclude for the day. I think. Just in time. Thank you. Thank you so much. It's not safe here. You should hurry and leave. Leave? Where would we go? This was a place where we could call home, but it's all ruined now. I'm sorry. It's not your fault. It's not. I didn't expect Reunion, the self-proclaimed savior of the infected, to attack other infected. Now that is what I call bad publicity. This Reunion infiltration did not just occur spontaneously. I'm sure that there were many infected here who chose to follow Reunion. Uh, I'd rather trust Reunion over Rhodes Island. Rhodes Island does not give empty promises. There are many infected who are willing to accept whatever Reunion offers, even if it's nothing more than an illusion. There are a few who can see through the illusion, and among those who can, most are willing to give up everything just for that vague glimmer of hope. Who would choose to believe our little bunny, who is too kind to deceive others? I believe her. Misha? <clears throat> Be careful, you can't move around yet. I'm just a bit dizzy, don't worry. Is Reunion still chasing us? I don't know what they want from me, but let's go. Amya. I understand. Let's leave right away. Shortly, we'll be able to exit the slums and meet up with the LGD. Thank you, Misha. No, I should be thanking you. All right. And so that is it for today. Definitely a very different, definitely a very different feeling from the usual. Yeah, a lot. I don't know, maybe not a lot, but yeah. I don't know. Like I said, there were topics I'd like to, would have liked to have been able to discuss a little bit. Not necessarily in any real detail, but things I would have had 
would have liked to have brought up. There we go. That's a combination of words that seems to be even remotely, remotely appropriate for the situation. But yes, topics I would have liked to have brought up. Um, and where else was I, where was I going? I don't know. In general, it was just a very, a differently paced stream than usual. But we made decent progress. That was, I think, a good four or five stages. So, but yeah, we're getting there. We're getting there. But yeah, I'm definitely, definitely glad to be back to this. Unfortunately, I don't know that I'm going to be able to... Well, yeah, so basically, I mentioned it in the previous stream during the... Yeah, in the previous Coffee Talk stream. But uh, starting with this next week, my work schedule is going to change somewhat. Basically, I'm going to be working later on Thursdays and Fridays, which will make those days very unlikely as stream days for me, unless maybe I could do another late stream like this. But I don't like starting this late and running this short, to be honest. Just not fidgeting with that. It's a little bit distracting. But yes, I don't like to... Yeah, I don't like to be sort of hurried like this. I don't like to be starting this late and running this short, like I just said. But I suppose more streams is better than not... than less streams, so... We'll see. I suppose it's not also... Since, yeah, my... I guess I'll have to see exactly how my schedule shakes out. But, because of how... Yeah, because of the changes, I will be starting later also. So it could be... If I can, I might be able... Or, yeah. I might be able to find the time to start... Yeah, I might be able to find this, the time to start a stream earlier in the day which could give me a little bit more time. That's worth looking into. I suppose I hadn't considered that. But yeah, anyway. So basically, one way or the other, the, yeah, Saturday is going to be sort of the main Arc Nights day, I think. I'm going to try to actually start on time going forward, but today was a bit of a special case. Yeah, there was some business I had to attend to and all that that delayed me. But yes. So, where was I? Oh yeah, so, next week, starting next week, my work schedule is going to be different, which will pose some challenges for us in the ways that I just described. Yeah. Monday is another potential day for me to stream on, but it's another day where I wouldn't be able to stream at the usual time consistently. Yeah, Monday is uh, an interesting sort of day for me. It's a day that's widely variable. Widely variable indeed. But yes, and Tuesday is not an option due to uh, due to external factors. But yes, Wednesday of course is already taken up, and I think that should be everything that needs to be said about the new schedule. Yeah, like I said, I hadn't really considered starting streams early in the day, morning, early afternoon, something like that. Yeah, I hadn't considered doing that before, so I'm not entirely sure. Yeah, I'm not entirely sure when I would be doing that if I were to stream earlier. But yeah, once again, I hope to do a lot more Arknight streams just in general. I would like to do more than one a week. I would like to do more than zero a week, but some weeks are just like that, you know. Trouble comes along and you simply must deal with it. But yes, so, yeah. Like I said, I hadn't considered the schedule changing or streaming at a different time, so I don't know when would be a good time. I don't know when I would be able to make time. But if I can, then I will try to to get more Arknight streams out each week. Yeah, again, I should be able to stream at a more normal time next Saturday and on and going forward. Um Let's see, anything else to be said? Nothing really with regards to the schedule, I don't think. So, I think it's about time that we wrapped up. Who do we want to raid tonight? I suppose, one thing, I think I, yeah. Yes, so, the, as per usual, 
If anyone has any raid suggestions, I would be delighted to hear them. If not, let's see. There's a lot of a lot of folks out there. A lot of folks out there that are available. So yes, it looks like we don't have a looks like we don't have a any suggestions. So I think what I will do. I think we'll go and visit Svella tonight, in a little while. Yes, looks like she is playing some Minecraft. Alright, I'll wait a second for the ad to finish before I go, so that I can actually, you know, interact with the stream when I get there, but I suppose that gives us some time to set up the raid. Yes, Svella, Prisera, Valkyrie, VTuber, yeah. We've known her for a little while, though again, it's been a while since we since we visited. Yeah, like I said, playing some Minecraft. And I suppose that's yeah. That is that. And I don't think I have anything else to add on my my end. I think I covered most of most of what there is to be said. So the ad is over, raid is ready. So the customary raid message is, as always, we have arrived. So, thank you all for being here tonight. I hope that you've had a fine night. I hope that you will continue to have a fine night every night. And I hope that you'll be well until the next time I see you. Yeah. Oh, hold on. How does my outro go again? Oh, dear. I'm sure I did my outro last time, so I don't know why I've forgotten it all of a sudden. It's not like it's been that long. Oh well. Anyway, I won't belabor the point. Thank you all for being here. Have a fine night. Farewell. Let's get this raid underway.